hello friends so today we will be looking at one of the most important design patterns and most frequently used design patterns which is the factory method design pattern so uh, we have already seen the simple factory design pattern if you have not seen please uh, watch that video of mine uh, i have created a simple factory design pattern video so that will be helpful to understand uh, this video so uh, we are having a car store so uh, and corresponding to that store we were having a car factory to create our cars so other other than the creation of car objects the welding painting etc we did in a car store so the varying part we separated it out in a car factory but now uh, let's say we are having two different factories so one is mahindra car factory and one is maruti suzuki car factory so in this case uh, what our simple factory implementation will say is this so we create a simple mahindra car factory simple factory and uh, parallelly for the next one maruti suzuki car factory we create a car store and pass it uh, the just created factory in the constructor similar for um, the maruti Su uh, suzuki uh, car store we uh, pass it the just created maruti suzuki factory and then we uh, call order method on the car store and pass whatever type of uh, car we want to order okay so basically what the problem with this approach is we uh, cannot see the implementation of car store that implementation is not transparent to us so whatever these uh, mahindra car factory maruti suzuki car factory they want to uh, use they can use the uh, their own car store uh, uh, class and uh, its order methods implementation so uh, painting they can skip painting they can uh, do welding as as in how they like etc etc those things they can do so we want to uh, take control of those things so what we do is we define an abstract class car store in that class we define this order or let's say order car here i am naming it differently order car method i provide a definition for it so this car store class is my class i provide the definition to the order car method i say uh, you have a car reference then uh, you call my create car method and then i will call press method on it weld method on it paint method on it and test method on it in the same sequence in this order i will call these methods and then finally i will return the car so i have decided upon the implementation and finalized the implementation return it in our order car method so uh, mahindra uh, car store maybe uh, maruti suzuki car store both have to follow and obey these implementations but uh, i don't know how to create a car yet so uh, that part i leave uh, creating the actual car objects that part i leave to the leave to the actual uh, car stores so this creating is not advisable to include in this because uh, creating is part of the factory object and uh, uh, so here we are uh, having this method create car and uh, basically factory object is now no longer existing we have a factory method this method will Uh, create the car for us and return us so hence this is called the factory method 
and hence this pattern is named as factory method pattern so uh, whatever so this is our base car store class whatever car stores are implementing this base car store have to uh, provide the definition for their own definition for the create car method other things uh, like car dot press weld print these things they have to uh, inherit from me and hence they have to obey the same things i am repeating again and again this is the main reason for uh, the factory method design patterns existence so whenever uh, i add a new uh, type of car or uh, new let's say I add mpv and remove hatchback and sedan so these changes will be in the base uh, in the subclasses only the base class or the super class will remain same so order car methods uh, definition will remain same so here the factory part is uh, separated out in a method which is defined abstract in our base class and which is uh, implemented in our subclasses so even if um, any change comes to the in terms of factory our uh, business logic will remain same and it is well separated out so we need not uh, go to our business class so this is our business class now and these classes who are implementing this factory method are responsible for object creation so uh, in this create car mahindra car store method uh, if type is equal to hatchback i create a verito object so this is a uh, hatchback by mahindra and mahindra and uh, if the type is equal to suv i create a scorpio and similarly for logan and i forgot to return the car sorry uh, after i have created the car i will return car here also return car so similarly if type is equal to uh, hatchback in uh, case of maruti suzuki car store i return a new alto similarly if suv vitara and if sedan i return a new cias object so now let's quickly skip to the um, class diagrams so uh, these are the product classes the car is the base class one on the one side we see varito scorpio and logan which are mahindra and mahindra's car and uh, on the other side we see alto vitara and cias which are maruti suzuki's car stores car and parallelly we see the creator classes so car store the uh, class having the actual business logic which is i want to be fixed in the order car method and an abstract factory method which is create car method again emphasizing abstract factory method so this that this is this method is a reason this pattern is called factory method pattern uh, which is implemented in two base classes two sub classes sorry the mahindra car store it is implementing this uh, create car method and maruti suzuki car store it is having its own implementation for this create car method so now let's uh, these were the uh, parallelly we were looking at both the product classes and the creator classes and now we will look at how uh, these are the class diagram is so these are the creator class as you have seen the factory method and uh, any operation and an operation is used as it is by the sub classes only the factory methods implementation is provided by them hence our creator class is abstract and this is a concrete creator like maruti suzuki car store etc similarly a uh, product car and the concrete products like vitara uh, varito etc so Uh, concrete creator basically produces concrete products so concrete creator uh, is associated with concrete product here like uh, mahindra car store will be creating these and maruti suzuki car store will be creating these so this is the basic uh, 
फैक्ट्री मेथड डिज़ाइन पैटर्न थैंक यू फ्रेंड्स